and I would just urge uh, him and others uh, to, uh, to back the team. Craig Whitaker. Mr Speaker, despite couples sat together one minute, one of them taken away in an ambulance the next, not being able to see their partner in hospital, not being able to see their partner in the chapel of rest, and if you live in Calderdale, you couldn't even pay your last respects at the crematorium either. And despite grandparents not seeing newborns for ten weeks, or indeed the grandchildren, on the whole, people have made huge sacrifices to maintain the lockdown and the government's public health message. Can my right honourable friend advise, therefore, uh, if an assessment has been done on what, if any, damage has been done to the government's public health message by the actions of the Prime Minister's special adviser? Uh, well, thank you, Mr Speaker. The critical, um, the critical thing is that, given the sacrifices that my honourable friend um, lists and that are heartfelt, that, as a nation, we have the resolve to see this through we can see that the number of cases is coming right down. Uh, we can see that the number of people dying is coming right down. And we've got to see the back of this disease. We are not there yet. 